Hey, this is Heather from the Renaissance English History Podcast, and this is your Tudor Minute for August the 24th. Today, in 1595, Thomas Diggs died. He was an astronomer and mathematician and was raised by the famous scientist occultist John Dee after his Thomas's father had died. Thomas was the first to expound in English on the Copernican system of a sun-centered solar system. He was also the first to postulate on an infinite-sized universe filled with an infinite amount of stars. At the time, there was this thing that was being thought about. I'm not a scientist, so I use really technical words like thing. It was called the dark sky paradox. And it was this paradox that with an infinite amount of stars, space should not be black space and the night sky should actually be lit up with hundreds of squidzillions of stars, right? And it's this paradox, the dark sky paradox. And mathematicians have been working out the rate at which the universe expands, all of this, which explains the dark sky paradox. And Diggs was actually one of the first people to start writing about that. He also spent some time in 1572 on the supernova that had confounded everyone as it appeared that a new star was actually forming in Cassiopeia for several months. And it turned out it was a supernova. And he worked on the mathematics of the orbit of the supernova. He was really busy with this. He also served as a member of parliament, so he didn't have a lot of free time. That's your Tudor Minute. Remember, you can dive deeper into life in 16th century England through the Renaissance English History Podcast at englandcast.com.